heater breakdown. Um, that's obviously got to be fixed. Who's our uh, who's our tinkerer? Probably caped eggy. You guys are ruthless. We have not lost a colonist yet. I mean, admittedly, um, you should take this. Oh, he's a brawler. Okay, disregard. Um, you should take it once you fix it then. Sw or actually, you know what, Swagonite? You got the best shooting skill, so you grab this. And then FP is still holding a rifle, I think. Or No, he dropped it elsewhere. Um, keep this guy going. Room tend infection chance factor, 50%. So I guess if we're going to keep this as our hospital, we should probably uh, put a sterile floor. We've actually got tailoring being done, which is amazing to me. We could use a heater in here. Hunter lacks ranged weapon. He's alive again. He's no longer incapable of walking. 74% immunity. 74% immunity. He's got it. Don't even sweat it. FP, go grab yourself. Wait, wait, are you the most amazing shooter? No, not really. Just grab grab yourself a little something something. Sterile floors are expensive as heck. That's true. Item deterioration. Your fridge's walls are made from jade ore. Yeah, I haven't mined it out yet. We'll mine it out. We've had we've had bigger problems. So if I remember correctly, the proper way to establish a kill box. Surely we want turrets, but we we are still doing research on our um, microelectronics base um, microelectronics basics, which means we won't be able to build turrets until our research is done. But we can at least build a kill box. So we want to go like, it's going to cost us a ton, but we could at least get the planning done on one side. On this side, I'm not that worried because they, they have to walk through the marsh anyway. Get the research going. Yo, I mean, I recognize I'm not the best player in RimWorld to begin with, okay? But we started with one drug addict, and we've been nursing him through withdrawal for literally 80% of the time that we've been playing the game. And he's our best uh, shooter. So that's a problem. And then Swagonite is like, I don't feel fulfilled in this colony, and he goes off. And then FP gets bitten by a fox on the tip of his dick, and he's injured for like six months. Like, it's out of control. So... No, not okay. Give them some freaking weed? You don't understand, this is too much of a metaphor for modern society. Two people are just sitting in bed while three people support the entire five people of the colony. I, I can't do this luxury stuff, okay? One, one day we'll do it, but for now, we have... We don't want to make wood walls. They're too, uh... They're too not good. So we're making slate, right? Work speed penalty, bad temperature. That makes sense. Um... You can heat your rooms by building a tunnel made out of walls from your geyser to your buildings. That's amazing. Make walls out of potatoes? Dude, I don't want to alarm you, but I think we're going to need those potatoes. Um, what do we, we have like, we have 60 slate blocks. That's essentially nothing. It's going to take me some time here to get this done. Um, we can build a 12 tile wide wall. Wood walls are fine for the early game. Yeah, but it uses like a lot of wood as well. Well, you know, maybe we'll just start by making sandbags. Let's get like a pseudo vote in chat. For now, it might be better to just make sandbags. And then have that be like, we can make like bunkers for our colonists that they can shoot out of, but... Or we could use wood walls and make like a temporary structure. Everyone's voting nay. They're saying wood walls. Okay, wood walls. All right, all right, all right. I default to your wisdom, chat. I default to your wisdom. So...
You have the slate for the walls anyway? I do, but I need to cut it is the thing. It adds one extra processing step. For now, at least. What what happened? Was there a there was a terrible audio sound or something? I don't know. Rip headphone users. I didn't hear anything. There was like a loud beep. Yeah, I noticed sometimes that happens. I don't know why. We'll just start by building the wall and then um We'll finish the kill box later, once it becomes a little easier. Chat's exaggerating? I'm aware, yes. Check your fridge. Don't make me laugh. I am gonna open and check the fridge, though. Looks close to me. Sorry, boys. From experience, going too big on a wood base is bad because of fire. Now, I recognize that 100%, but I, we're in, like, the wood age right now. When we get to the slate age, I'm gonna be a happy camper. Um, he's gonna he's gonna beat the infection, which is very nice for me. Make sure you're eating. How many meals? We got 12 meals. The colony is like almost. He's about to. 97. What? What? Cargo pods. Heater breakdown was over. Mental break days. Perhaps you'll find something useful in the wreckage. Oh, dude! That's actually... It's close, and the wool is very useful, actually. No, no, no. He's not dead. He's, he's actually gonna make it. He's almost 100% immune. We'll never need tending. Yeah. So he is... He's now on the up and up. Let's save. Spicy Hospy. You never answered the squirting question. Okay, what is the squirting question? And SR, what is wrong with you? Incapacitated, why? Just, just due to withdrawal? Did you know that Amazon Prime members have access to a new feature called Twitch Prime? Could you tell me a little bit more about this feature? I'm unaware of it. Oh, we're, we're hunting a fox. Someone's hunting a fox? FP! He's, he's gone wild! Bulk goods trader from the National Compact of Aradio. Dude. He's done it. A red fox is attacking after being harmed. Yeah, well, good luck, buddy. Nothing personnel, kid. Free meat for the meat gods. Dude, you guys were right about the wood. Like, I'll tell you a million percent. It's taking, like, less than 5%. Is there a... There is an eclipse. That's a... It's a problem. In the winter time. But, uh... It took, it took less than 5% of our wood, and now we've established a choke point. Now, if they ever shoot a, a flamethrower at it, it's all going up in smoke, but still. Alright, so let's, uh, who's our social leader? It's been a while since I, well, I mean, we were only playing it, like, once a week. Sometimes I have to remind myself who our social leader is. Four, it's SR, isn't it? No, SR is a, SR is a four. Swagonite is a six. You should finish cooking this meal. And then I'm gonna... What are you doing right now? Cooking simple meal? Important, but not as important as, uh, as trading. Who, who is the... Who's the trader? Masset? What are you... You, like, infinity years old? SR equals social reader. Ooh, he cannot talk properly because of poor health? What's his problem? Because he's frail? He's got an old gunshot in his torso? 
All right, FP, you're going to have the conversation here. What about FP? FP cannot talk properly because of poor health. That makes sense. That one I'm not too cheesed off about. NL's hair. There we go. Things are more expensive with NL's hair. Even though he's not uh, sick. So, what do I... I want to sell things I'm never going to use. I need this muffalo meat, dude. I need the rice. I need the components. Um, sell SR. I mean, look, we're probably never going to use, like, half of this leather, but I think we should just keep it for now. I'm not going to pay you 1600 bucks for a helmet. Who do you think I am, Austin? Sell dead people's clothes? Well, I'm assuming, like, all of these clothes are dead people's clothes, then? Buy rice from them. Now, that's a good idea. 163 rice is a strong, strong move. I mean, maybe even tortoise meat. Although it would cost us, like, we'd almost be out of silver at that point. Oh, hey, Josh. How's it going? Any clothes with D you can sell. So at least we can, like, they'll haul them for us, so... All right, so they really have emphasized having to make your own clothes now. Don't spend all your silver or you'll have no uh, sterile flooring tools. That's true. So we're selling good clothes, but the way that people have told it to me is that um, it's better to make your own clothes because of the mood debuff. So they'd rather be cold than wear a dead person's jacket, which is honestly just extremely millennial to me, but, you know, no problem, I suppose. Turn SR into clothing? <laughs> Not necessary. Not necessary at the present moment. The colony's going okay right now. I still don't understand how, uh, SR is, uh, How SR is uh, incapacitated, but again, it's probably better for us that he is incapacitated. He's gotten 10% of the way through the uh, through the withdrawal symptoms already. Dude, Caped Eggy is just absolutely awful at cutting trees. Just straight up garbage. We can go to speed 3 temporarily, because the colony is actually going okay. Why do you have an emote for Josh, but not for Kate? Um... Well, the simple answer is that Josh is on the show more than Kate, but I am in the process, which means it could be months or a lifetime, but, you know, there's other people that come on the show that we should have emotes for. You know, we should have a Kate, we should have a Sinvicta emote, we should maybe have a Mathis emote. There's a hole in the wall? Ah, yes, but you see, the reason we have a hole in the wall is um, because that's where we want people to funnel out of. Funnel into, I suppose. So we have, like, a great shot at them when they come in. Fudge that. Make all the emotes, Josh. Unlikely, Josh. Unlikely. So these guys are leaving. Well. I'm not convinced we're going to get a wall test, but we might. He didn't say fudge. I know. I know you didn't say fudge, Josh. SR is not being fed and he's in real bad shape. He's got trivial malnutrition. Should have thought of that before you got addicted to go juice. Was this uh, attack immediately or prepare for a while and then attack? LMG? Oh my god, he's got an M249. It seems like they're probably going to come on the lower side here. Um... So, I'm, I mean, mood is okay right now. So, I'm going to try to wall off the area that's around our solar panels. Is anybody awake? No. Whose mood is not bad? Swagonite? Congratulations. Beggars can't be choosers.
The roofed area is unwalled. We build a roof over the solar panels to keep the snow off them. Now that's actually genius. Um, we also don't really have good cover, but I mean, in our last raid, we didn't have a wall at all. So, right, he'll be unhappy. Um, and he'll be unhappy. Oh, wouldn't it be nice? They're not attacking? They're not attacking yet. Okay, disregard, disregard. Go back to sleep. I know you're mad. Get over it. Um, Swag and I, where did I put you? Right. Hauling wood to wall. Yeah, I'm going to need you to build that, please. FP. Oh, sorry, you can go back to go back to sleep. Or you know what? Help construct the wall. As best as you can. Just anything to deter them. Anything to deter them from attacking the solar panels is a start, dude. Okay, they're beginning their assault, so I have no idea if this worked at all. What? Oh, they're killing the vi- <laughs> Oh my god, dude! First off, the villagers went nuts on him! Pirates from the shotguns are fleeing! Yo, enjoy your sleep! On behalf of these guys right here. SR is no longer incapable of walking. I don't really want to take a prisoner. Free loot. That, exactly, dude. Free freaking loot. I'm extremely pleased with the way that went down. Capture the dudes. As <laughs> FP is now no longer injured. Which is a great day for me. Somebody somebody feed this poor man. Oh, he's gonna do it, okay. Strip the down guys before they die and they get you get free clothes. That is valid. Now that's a good idea. Who's awake here? Someone someone's constructing a wall. Nah, no, forget hauling wood, dude. Strip Fuentes. SR woke from his slumber to mentally slay the raiders. Now that's exactly true. Um, I want you to strip this guy before he dies, please. And then, oh, he's mad. Hunter lacks range. SR is no longer incapable of walking again. Thanks for bleeding all over my crops, dude. Really appreciate it. Hey, uh, we have power again. This is nice. All right, what are you doing here? Hauling this wool. Dude, positive move. Thank you very much. Rescue the traitor. Why? Traitor, rescue. Which one of these is... Oh, blackjack? Fine. No, SR, you can't do anything. If you're just cleaning dirt, you can rescue Blackjack. There you go. What did they ever do for us? I'm gonna rescue rather than capture because they were so nice to me. That we should save them. But, will I give them medicine? I don't know, the jury's out. You get the worst hospital room too. No offense. Where are you going? Where are you? Okay, what are you hauling? Bolt action rifle, cloth button down shirt. So these clothes might be like acceptable. But these guys, obviously, like I'm just gonna let them die out here. I don't I don't think we get a mood debuff if we didn't kill them. SR slowly 80% of the way through the withdrawal here. There's another one. Is there? Cause like these two people are from or these people are all from the shotguns. Ah, uh, no, the geneticist wasn't. But I think they were dead anyway. 
They'll get a mood debuff for seeing dead people. Yeah, that is true. You're not wrong about that. Okay, well, I mean, we've I think we've done a good job here on this side. Um, we still have a ton of wood. I've really overestimated the amount of... Uh, why, what, you can't build here because of the snow? Is that the case? Buy it next to the wall? Oh, you mean this guy... Well... Who can say where the wind blows? Where the day goes? Only time... We still got his boy, though. Consume. No, they get a huge... Everyone's always like, don't put them in a dead guy's toque. They don't like it, and they get a debuff. And then they get such a huge debuff for eating human flesh, it affects them forever, and everybody's like, do it. Do it right now. If you had a lawn, how often would you mow it? I think mowing your lawn in the summer is like a once every two weeks sort of deal. I used to mow, uh, I used to mow my lawn when I, uh, was, you know, living in my parents' house. Okay, well, let's, let's wall it off here to start with. We don't want them to be able to get in through there. We need to build, like, the choke points and stuff in here, but that's okay. Um, what, I, I don't understand why we can't build here. Is it because there's too much snow? The terrain here cannot support this. This is not a river. This is... I don't believe this is a river, at least. Good, yeah, go to sleep, dude. SR is probably gonna have another breakdown soon, but I'm pretty pleased with the way this is going. It's a marsh. Yeah, but I'm really scared of them having to, like, go out this way. I guess... If we get invaded from this side... They're going to have a debuff from coming in through the, the swamp anyway, so. Alright, so other things people have asked for that we should pretty easily be able to take care of. Zone. Expand build roof area. Roof the area. Around our solar panels. Just put up some turrets. Fair enough. No, oh, wait, wait, I'm I'm a moron. I thought about it for two seconds and realized you can't put a roof over the solar panels. You won't get any solar energy, you jokers. Hey, you guys actually believed that I was about to do that. <laughs> oh, I was born at night, but not last night. <laughs> well, I'm not going to end the stream. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Um... In my brain, I was like, well, the solar panel is just where the energy is stored, which is actually what a battery is. Um, the, uh, they just send probes out into the sun that come back with the energy, right? What about wind turbines? We don't need it yet? Like, honestly, our electricity requirements are very low. Oh, my lord. What are your skills like? Ugh. What do you think? Should we capture this guy? SR is also starving to death. Make graves outside the wall to intimidate raiders. I like that because I don't think it's an actual game mechanic, but you're thinking outside the game and that's emerging gameplay. He's abrasive. Tends to rub people the wrong way. His faction will become hostile. Okay, I'm just gonna...